Gabby Petito, who disappeared while on a cross-country road trip with her boyfriend. He returned home to Florida without Gabby, and now her parents are pleading for help to find her. Eva Pilgrim is here with more on that for us. Good morning, Eva. Good morning, Robin. Her family says she was a free spirit who loved adventure. She just started a YouTube channel documenting her adventures when she vanished. Her family telling us they have no idea where she could be this morning. This morning, a plea for help. Gabby Petito's family looking for any clues as to what happened to the 22 year old who was on a cross country adventure with her boyfriend when she disappeared. We don't know. We don't, we don't know where she is. A few days is one thing when you're out camping, but um, when it starts to become seven, eight, nine, ten days, that's that's a problem. Petito was traveling the country in this van with her boyfriend, Brian Laundry. I think our plan for today is to just hang out here in the tent. Um, Brian's stretching. The pair, documenting their journey on social media and YouTube, left New York on July 2nd, making stops in Colorado and Utah. So, we are right outside Capitol Reef right now. The New York native was last seen on August 24th, checking out of a hotel with laundry in Salt Lake City, Utah. Her mother says she last spoke to her by phone the next day. She told her they were in Grand Teton, Wyoming, on their way to Yellowstone National Park. She sounded good and excited to continue her trip and excited to start her YouTube channel. And um, she was, I don't know, she seemed okay. Laundry at some point returned to the couple's home in Florida with their van, but Petito was not with him. The FBI and police departments in New York and Florida all investigating. Northport Police Department saying they currently have no definitive information that a crime took place here, adding the circumstances are odd. ABC News reached out to Laundry for comment, but did not receive a response. She was also an amazing artist. Yeah, she loved man. to take pictures and get them out there as much as possible. Um, she loved natural beauty. She was an amazing person. She always tried to smile and make people smile and, and always enjoyed, you know, every moment. That's you know, it's something to be admired. And she's just she's just awesome. We love her. We miss her. We want her home. Now, her mom says that she did get two more texts from her daughter before she went silent, but no photos and no calls. So she's not sure if her daughter was actually the one sending those messages. The family is asking anyone who may have seen her to please come forward. There's just a lot of time that they are trying to fill in the gaps as to what happened. As we said, such odd circumstances. Yeah. Eva, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.